In this video, I'm going to share with you a simple formula which you can use in Excel as well as in Google Sheet for task scheduling. So you can see we have certain tasks, we have the start date, we have the frequency, mean, after how many days the task has been repeated. For example, the task one start from Monday 2024. So you can see on the top we have the dates and from Monday this task has been started and after each five days this task will repeat it. Let's say consider the task four. The task four start from Tuesday and after every five days this task has been repeated. If I change even the five, let's say 10, so it will repeat after every 10 days. Now for the two, let's go together. To develop the formula, first I will increase the width of the certain columns. Just we understand the concept. First, I will type equal to the sequence function. For the sequence function, how many rows? In this case, I will just input one. How many columns? I'm just going to input 100. You can increase the number if you have long scheduling list. For the start, I will just choose start date B6 comma and I will select the C6 for step but I cannot select C6 so I will just select C5 using arrow key down I'm just going to select C6 close the bracket hit enter and this will generate a list of dates I need to format these dates just to understand a concept so short date so you can see we have the dates based on frequency so start date is this one and after every five days this generate a list of date for us now we need to use match function for the match function where is your lookup video so all of the date on my scheduling list, I'm just going to select all of the date. And in this case, I will hit F4 key just to lock the reference because I will drag this formula down. So the reference must be locked. Hit comma and my lookup array is the sequence function I generated. And for the may type, I will simply type zero, close the bracket, hit enter. And this will generate some numbers, NA and numbers. And you can see first date and after every five days this generate a number for us now we will use is number function if i type is number open the bracket and close the bracket hit enter this will generate a list of true and false and i just need to replace the true with x and the false with empty now we will simply type if this whole function result become true i want to appear x otherwise i want to appear the null value close the bracket hit enter and this will generate our result now what we need to do we just need to drag this formula but this will change my formatting so i'm just going to click fill without formatting and this will keep my original formatting now if i just change let's say three to let's say two this will repeat the task after every two days and this is how we can simply create this amazing formula not only this formula work in excel but this formula also work in same google sheet so this is the same layout google sheet and you can see the same formula but the only difference we need to type array formula before if condition i hope you like this simple formula please subscribe my channel for more video thank you so much